Hi, welcome to our wrap-up video for September and October. I'm Jo and I'll be covering some of the great enhancements we've released in the last couple of months. Many of these will improve your business efficiency and productivity. We've reduced repetitive manual processes, introduced automation and streamlined workflows. We have you to thank for these enhancements. Your continual feedback helps us focus our efforts on the things that matter most. Let us know what you think about these enhancements by clicking the Rate This Enhancement button. We really appreciate your feedback. Export BI data. Our BI Vision users have really been looking forward to this enhancement. You can now export your BI dashboard data as a CSV file, so you can easily see full details and further manipulate the raw data. With this update, you can also choose to view as many results as you like on your BI dashboards. This feature is available to BI Vision users only. Share costs across multiple purchase orders. Now you can apply costs, such as shipping, across multiple purchase orders. This feature removes the manual work of having to go through each of the purchase orders, calculate and distribute the costs. Assign ship note templates to customers. You can now assign ship note templates to your customers. Just like how you assign templates for quotes, orders, invoices and packing slips, you can now assign a ship note template for each customer. The designated ship note template will automatically populate when you ship products to your customers. More information in View Customers. You can now add two new columns to your View Customers screen, last order date and sales group. Drag and drop these columns into the page to give you quick visibility of when your customers last ordered and where these orders are coming from. Create a combined pick list template. You can now create a template of your combined pick list in Doc Designer. This will improve your workflow when it comes time to pick and pack your sales orders. You can also print this document using the bulk action cog in View Sales Orders. View supplier lead times for products. You will now be able to see lead times for individual products at a glance on the View Products page. Not every product coming from a supplier will have the same lead time. This enhancement will definitely help you manage lead times, especially if you source from overseas suppliers. Add a purchase cost grid to your purchase orders. You can now add a purchase cost grid to your purchase orders in Doc Designer. Use this to add purchase cost information such as supplier name, cost, cost date, exchange rates and more. This enhancement gives you more flexibility over your templates, improving how you share information with your suppliers. View sales orders against auto assemblies. You can now add sales order to the view assemblies table. Drag and drop this column to see and hyperlink to the sales orders that correspond to the auto assemblies. This enhancement makes it much easier for you to access and keep track of the sales order that generated the auto assembly. View serial and batch numbers on the product page. You are now able to view serial and batch numbers on the product page, so you won't need to run a batch inquiry report. This is especially useful in achieving serial and batch number transparency. That wraps up our September and October enhancements, but we have more enhancements coming soon, including generate new assemblies from reorder reports, bulk actions for sales shipments, import and export assemblies, display stock availability for B2B store, and more. Remember, you can always find the latest enhancements and more on our Feature Enhancements page. While you're there, don't forget to let us know what you think by clicking the Rate This Enhancement button. We really appreciate your feedback. See you in the next wrap-up video.